Excuse me, Mr. Wood. Yeah, look, before you ask, look, there's, there's nothing I can do. I'm sorry, it's out of my hands. There's nothing I could have done. Oh, and don't I know it. You haven't been able to do anything since all this kicked off. I want to know why Tom was suspended. You know why? It's been explained to you. Well, you're his teacher. I want to hear it from you. I don't want to hear it from a letter. Okay. He was involved in a fight. And that is an automatic suspension. And do you know why he was in a fight? Look, if you have an issue with the decision that's been made, then you need to bring that up with the head teacher. He was defending himself. Those boys have been bullying him for months. Well, what did you expect him to do? Lie down and take it? Of course not. I, I think he did exactly as he should have. And why didn't you stand up for him? Defend him against that suspension? I tried. I tried again and again. But the, the head teacher, he won't listen to anyone, right? Those bullies. One of them is his son. You won't hear a bad word said against him. Sounds like bullying behaviour runs in the family. Tom won't get any more help here. All any of us can do is leave. But all his friends, all his favourite teachers, even would turn his whole world upside down. I know, and he's punished for being the victim. But at least, at least to be out. If you need me to put a, a good word in, you know, with other schools, then... Yeah. And if, if you decide to get out yourself, and go into private teaching, I might have some work for you. Take me far away from here. 